in the first rivalry matchup of 2022. The ASU baseball team turned a two-run deficit into a four-run victory over U of A Tuesday night in Phoenix. Heading into the midweek matchup, the Sun Devils were a major underdog to the Wildcats, who were ranked number 11 in the country at the time. For the first time since March 6th, Boyd Vanderkoy took the mound for ASU. After opening the game with a strikeout, Vanderkoy hit the second batter and then gave up a two-run homer to give U of A an early two-run lead. The Sun Devils responded right away with a leadoff single from Joe Lampy. Connor Davis and Jacob Tobias reached base before Ryan Campos singled, scoring Lampy from third. The Wildcats continued their aggressive attack in the top of the second with a solo home run, a double, and two walks before Jacob Walker came in to take over on the mound for Arizona State. Walker pitched to contact, forcing a double play to end the inning. After Alex Champagne led off the bottom of the second with a single, Cam McGee homered to right center, tying the game at three. However, the Wildcats weren't done yet. A solo home run in the fourth and a few base hits in the fifth put them back on top, five to three. ASU went to the bullpen once again, this time calling on Will Levine. After Connor Davis and Ryan Campos got on base in the bottom of the fifth, Nate Baez singled to score Davis, and a three-run homer by Kai Murphy put the Devils up seven to six. ASU head coach Willie Bloomquist said his players are finally understanding the importance of getting on base while not trying to do too much at the plate. Good things will happen, not trying to hit the three-run homer themselves and, and just figure out a way to get on base, and those are how the, the big innings start uh, taking to fruition uh, when guys just put together good at bat after good at bat. The Sun Devils extended their lead with a two-RBI single by Jacob Tobias, scoring Sean McLean and Joe Lampy in the sixth. After a quiet seventh inning, Blake Piveroff took over on the mound in the eighth, posting a 1-2-3. Excellent base running by Joe Lampy added another run in the eighth after an error at the plate. In the ninth, Piveroff set down U of A in order to cement the 10-6 victory. Next, the Sun Devils hit the road for a three-game series at Stanford, starting Friday at 6.05 p.m. Reporting in Phoenix, Paul Schultz, Inferno Intel.